Hey, how's it going everybody? It is Josh Thomas here from the Vip Block, and I'm gonna give you my live, well not live, but I'm gonna give you my reaction, my reaction to the Ukulele E3 2016 trailer. Um, this is one of my most anticipated games. I love 3D platformers. I'm very sad that they have died. I mean, I don't know why nobody makes them anymore. Even Nintendo doesn't make them. So uh, I, yeah, I mean, I'm really hyped for this game. Uh, this is like half of my E3 excitement, the other half being Zelda. And other than that, I don't know what I'm excited about. But anyways, let's watch the trailer. Here we go. Let's do this. Not yet rated. All right, got it. Tim four. Ooh, sparkly logos. That's a good way to start. Whoa. All right. A lot of excitement right off the bat. Ooh. Oh, look at the little grumpy cloud guy. All right, you can ball up Yuka and roll on him. Some pretty high up platforming. Collecting feathers. Oh, firepower! All right, minecart. This is very Donkey Kong Country inspired. Oh, what? Oh my God! You can transform in this game. Was that announced? You was a Yuka was like a plant. All right, I hate snow worlds though. I do not like snow worlds. I hate the cold, but it looked pretty. Some underwater stuff. This game looks well. Oh, wait a minute! Did he just like use his tongue to lick something that turned to metal? There was the N64 uh, dinosaur. You can. Sp oh my gosh! I want this bad. Ah, oh, it's so pretty. I love the like tribal, tropical feel of this game. That looks like. And you know what I like most about what they just showed? It's, it's got like. A big scope to it, like the scale of the worlds looks great. Like I just want to explore and do nothing in those worlds. I just like want to hop around in those levels. Oh, what's this? Listen to the way they talk. I'm sure they'll get it in for release. There's still a few months work left. Probably have car <laughs> poking fun at themselves. Oh, they've got little. They have little uh, towels there that look like them. I love the way they talk, by the way. I didn't mention that because I was busy reading it, but that gibberish speak, um, that's like, I know some people might think that's annoying, but I actually like when characters talk like that. Um, Chibi Robo, basically all of Skip's, ga uh, Skip's games do that. And of course, um, Rare's old games, they do that, like in Banjo and that. I like that. I like gibberish speak. I think it adds a lot of character to the characters. Uh, wow, what do I think of that? That looked pretty great. That's kind of what I wish Nintendo were doing with Mario. Uh, I want more. I don't like that snow world. It looked pretty, but I hate the snow, and I hate the winter. Uh, but it, it looked good, but I just hate snow. I know that's like a totally stupid complaint, um, but everything else looked good. I thought the platforming looked neat. I like the way there was a part, there was a part where you jump through a ring, which then activated platforms afterwards for you to land on, so that could be pretty interesting. It seems like the gameplay is definitely there, and that's good. Music was there, that was some pretty exciting, intense music. That sounded like maybe it was something that would be in a boss battle. Um, I like it. Minecart stuff? I don't know how I feel about the minecart stuff, because we did that a lot in Donkey Kong Country Returns, and Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze recently, and that stuff looked kind of basic compared to what Retro Studios did with minecart stuff. I don't know, though. I mean, whatever, I'll take some minecart stuff. It just does seem a little bit like we've done this a million times. Um, but other than that stuff, I love it. Love the way it looked. I love the transformation ideas. I love using your tongue to do things. That's going to be awesome. I just want to lick everything. I'm going to just go around and ukulele and lick everything. I'm sharing too much information about myself, so that's where I'm going to end this. Thank you guys for watching my reaction video for the ukulele E3 2016 trailer. Keep it locked right here to the bit block for a lot more reaction videos on uh, basically all things E3 2016. See you guys later.